I was a fan of Atlantic Grand Prix wrestling when I was a kid growing up, and wrestling continues to be a sought-after sport in this region. Joining me is wrestling promoter Dave Boyce. Dave, tell me about this really cool event that you got coming up in March. Hey, uh, thanks for having me, Scott. So, um, yeah, March the 11th, we're having a, a wrestling event at the uh, Parkside Pub and Smokehouse in Dartmouth, Nova Scotia. It's at 14 Highfield Park. It's a um, it's an establishment that I know all too well. We go there every Thursday for their wings uh, for the last couple of years. Uh, the staff had been fantastic with us there. And uh, once they get wind that our table full our wrestlers, um, they've been after me for about two years to have a wrestling event there. And we're finally doing it. It will be uh, Saturday night, March the 11th, uh, bell times at 9 o'clock. And it should be a really, really interesting uh, environment to have a wrestling show. Why do you think that wrestling has such a hold in the fabric of Atlantic Canada? It, it, it lets you uh, leave reality for a bit. You know, you just go there for a couple hours and you, you get to cheer the good guys and boo the bad guys and you just forget about real life problems. And it's so um, entertaining. It's so dramatic. It's so funny. It's so maddening. It's so happy. It's, it's everything. And you get lost in that world for two hours. And I think, you know, wrestling through the years, they've tweaked it and, and whatnot, but it's the, it's the basic good guy versus bad guy you get lost in that world and it's uh it's it's like a real life action movie tickets available at eventbrite.ca uh excited for this event coming up and i'm hoping to be able to make it out there myself yeah please come i'll, I'll buy you a beer <laughs> sounds good and maybe a couple of chicken wings too huh maybe i you know, we'll see <laughs> i'm cheap all right thank you for, thanks for your time appreciate you doing this yeah thank you for having me in halifax I'm Scott Squires for the Atlantic Sportswire.